that? That's right. Yeah, yeah which actually fought a war in Carthage where the Hebrews, the Hebrews were there, right? Mm -hmm. So that's, that war was against Hannibal Barco, you know? But what they did, what they did basically is that when they invaded Carthage, all right, in the Punic War, they wanted to, they went in and took, took that land over. Yeah. All right, and as, as a way of uh, celebrating the victory, they said, hey, this land could be called Africa. Africa, Because correct. when you check the history, his brother Asianus, Africanus, he went to Asia. Mm -hmm. You see? Mm -hmm. Yep, yep. So yep. Th this is all things that are written in history and in scripture. Because the scripture tell you that the Edomites, all right, when Alexander the Great was set up, they had four generals that were, that came us, came out after his death. Mm -hmm. And they this then wickedness, you know, flourished in the earth under their rulership. Yeah, the kingdom was divided into four. That's right. Right? Yeah. You so want to you, you yeah, ask which, which, which are yeah. Oh, still yeah. Right here, bro. We be right out in the street. This is where we worship. When you look up the word church, it means Ecclesiastes, it means gathering, call out, That's assembly. Right. This is where we assemble to give the most high thanks and praise. That's right. Right? This is where we, we give in the most. Give me um give me Romans chapter 12 and 1 quick. Let me show you something, bro. I beseech you therefore, brethren, uh -huh. by the mercies of Yahweh, uh -huh. that ye present your bodies a living sacrifice. Right, you were looking at here, we are living sacrifice. Alright. Alright, listen. This 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 how this happening right now is that. You come, you take the teaching, and you're going to teach your family. Right? This is what the men does. Right? we the head. Men, we take the knowledge because one of the things women understand is power. And this wisdom is power. So when you get this knowledge, you go, you teach your family. Right? Your woman, you're supposed to teach your woman. The scriptures say that if a woman should learn anything, let her ask her husband. Right? And the scripture tell you, give me a... Um, Give me um, Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy chapter 4, and I think it's the 8th verse. Yeah, yeah, please help. Give me a minute, they'll get it. Deuteronomy chapter 4 and 8. Go ahead. And what nation is there so great that had statutes and judgment so righteous as all this law, Go ahead. which I set before you this day? Go ahead. Verse 9, only take heed to thyself. Uh -huh. Take keep... heed to thyself. Take heed, meaning listen, be diligent. Right, go ahead. And keep thy soul diligently. Keep your soul diligent. How are you going to keep your soul diligent? By you applying yourself to learning. This wisdom, this knowledge and understanding. Go ahead. Least thou forget the things which thine eyes have seen. Uh -huh. And least they depart from thine heart. Right. In all the days of thy life. So you need to be in this book. You need to, when you see we out here, you come out here. Right? When I was coming in the truth, I used to be the force, one of the force to be out to, to get this. And I was standing right where you were standing. Don't worry with the system, bro. You come out when you could come out. without videos. You could edify yourself. This is why the scripture tell you about the unicorn, which is the internet. You understand that knowledge could go, go throughout the whole heart, my brother. Right? Go ahead. Continuing on, it says, At least, they, at, least they, the voice a bit now. at least they depart from thine heart uh -huh. all the days of thy life, Go ahead. but teach them thy sons and thy sons' sons. So we, you, you have to teach your son's son. You have to teach your wife. You have to grab knowledge. Right? We the men. We, we are men. The scripture says, remember to show yourself men. You understand? And to be a man, you got to gotta get rule over your household. You understand? This knowledge. The scripture says wisdom and knowledge can be the stability in the time in this time. That's right. So you need the knowledge to protect your family. Right. right? No guns, no sword, no, no bunker, no nothing going to help you but the name of your Hawa Bash and your Shai. This truth. That's right. Right? Where many right. precept? This is Acts chapter 7 mm -hmm. and verse 48. Mm -hmm. It says, How be it? 
the most high dwelleth not in temples made with hands. Right, the most high dealing in this temple, bro. This church, this, this Sabbath. This, we know the Sabbath, we observe the Sabbath by the moon, brother. Right? The moon, we don't go with Saturday. Right? For instance, the Sabbath right now is falling on Sunday evening to Monday evening. That's right. There's all the moon. We work with the moon. When you look up the word moon, it go back to the word month. That's right. This is how we understand how we get the Sabbath. Don't worry, this this Saturday thing to it. Right? Go ahead. I said the prophet, mm -hmm. heaven is my throne uh -huh. and earth is my footstool. We don't. What house will you build me? Right, what house we could build? The scripture said this is our house. This is the house of the most high dwelling. Yeah. Read it. Hold this it. This is 1 Corinthians chapter 3 and verse 9. Go ahead. For we are laborers together mm -hmm. with the most high. We are the most high's husbandry. Uh -huh. We are the most high's building. We are the most high's building. Gosh. You understand? The scripture goes so far to call us lively storm, bro. That's right. Lively storm, king. That's right. Go ahead, I read on. Go on, say. Heaven is my throne. Heaven is the most high throne. And art is my footstool. Read on. What house will you build me? Uh -huh. Said Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. God. Or what is the place of my rest? Wait, which part you could put in most high to rest? This temple? This temple is the most wicked thing this one. The scripture said it. Tell, give me Jeremiah. Jeremiah chapter 5 or 7. Let me show you what the most I say about the, these churches, bro. This is not my word. I just, I, hey, we just the messenger. Go ahead, huh? This is Jeremiah chapter 5 and verse 7. Uh -huh. It says, Oh, shall I pardon thee for this? Yeah. Thy children are forsaking me. The children are forsaking me. How the most death, the children are forsaking the most high. By what? Going in these war houses? Going to these buildings and worship other gods? This is how you forsaken the most high. We don't have. Huh? It says, how shall I pardon thee for this? Uh -huh. Thy children are forsaken me. What? And sworn by them that are no God. This says your bullshit. Jesus ain't no God. Right. Allah ain't no God. Krishna, right. Buddha, and all of them, they ain't no God. God right. Jehovah, they ain't no God. Right. Selassie, they ain't no God. That's right. right. There's one true power, and his name is the no, power of Bashem Yahushai. You understand? And we get an understanding to the Rakak Wadash, the Holy Spirit. That's right. Go ahead, huh? Yeah, finishing up. Go ahead. Saying, when I had fed, the, fed them to the full, mm -hmm. they have committed adultery. When did the Lord fed us to the full? When we was in the wilderness. That's right. The most I sent his servant Moses to give us what? The law, statutes, and commandments. That's he right. feed us spiritually and physically, bro. That's right. The clothes that we had didn't even wear now. We had money for it, like today, right now. The, 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 the money that was hidden, man, we eating that money right now, brother. That's right. And it is sweet. That's right. The scripture says, oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. We eating it right now. The hidden manna is these mysteries where it's being revealed unto us. Now, some, some, some simple ass man would say, yeah, but the, the, the uh, manna was in the, the, um, the Ark of the Covenant. But guess what? Yahushai is the Ark of the Covenant. That's, That's right. Right. That's right. Right? And he's the one who giving us this food to eat. This manna. That's right. He's the one who giving us this white stone. That's right. This big tree. That's right. You have more there, brother? Yeah, it says, and assemble themselves by troops in mm -hmm. the Arlet Houses. They assemble themselves by troops. There's these churches, these universal churches, bro. That's right. Christian and it, he call it what the Arlet, Arlet. The wo next word is what a whore house. That's right. The Mosai dealing with these whore houses, my brother. That's right. This is what the Mosai, the true church is here. The scripture said, where one or two is gathered in my name, dear am I. Where, brother? Right why it call our Harlot houses too, because wisdom is being um, described in the scripture as a woman. That's, That's right. right. The word wisdom, the Greek, the Latin word is Sophia. That's right. Right. So now, being a woman, you know, in evening clubs, it's got Harlot is being said this. So in these churches that were taught by oppressors, it's basically different, um, different doctrine, mixed doctrine. Yeah. That's why they call it our uh, Harlot houses. Yeah. That's right. It's different with the bringing. Babylonian doctrine, Romanic do doctrine. Mm. They bring in the, um, you know where they teach who we learn Christianity from? Yeah. Who we learn Islam from? Yeah. Before the transatlantic slave trade, it was the sub-Sahara slave trade. Yeah. Yeah. Right? So 
Trans-Sahara. Trans, Trans-Sahara and Sub-Sahara. Yeah. yeah, right? So it's like, that's why a lot of we convert in religions and not in our heritage. We confuse religion for heritage. Mm -hmm. Right? Is that precept, This is 1 Corinthians chapter 3 and verse 16. Mm -hmm. It says, Know ye not that ye are the temple of God, and that the Spirit of God dwelleth in you? And what is the Spirit of God? Going back to the last statutes and commandments. The Spirit of God is going back to these scriptures, the last statutes and commandment. This wisdom and understanding, the doctrine of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. So, once you got this wisdom inside of you, once you got this doctrine inside of you, you mean the temple, this is this what you fill yourself with. You will fill yourself with this knowledge. Right? So, to all day in, in, in the scripture also says, right? Um, the Mosai does not dwell in temple made with hands. You understand? So simply it's, it's saying that also, what are you doing there? You being the temple of God, what are you doing in the temple built made with hands? Scripture also advises us to come out in the street. Ask God, please, a See, like, let me add a little more to what you said because it say what? The, that the temple of the Mosai is not made with hands. This body wasn't made with hands. You understand? It's the Mosai who created this body. Right. That's why the scriptures say the most I dwell it in what? This is the temple. God, that's right. The temple of make with hand and tongue, but these houses. Right. But this is the Lord dwell it in here. That's the right. scripture tell you in the um in um I think the second Corinthians chapter four and seven, for we have this treasure in autumn vessel that we we should not boast about it, but it's of the most high. So it's the most high who's actually talking to you and to us, brother. That's right. So technically. You in you are you in church right now. That's right. Right. Being edified. You understand? You in church right now and you being baptized. That's right. You've been changed. That's right. Precept. I'll get a precept here. Yeah. This is um Proverbs chapter 8 and verse 1. It mm -hmm. says, Doth not wisdom cry and understanding put forth her voice. She standeth in the top of the high places. By the way of the places of the path. So this is the high this is a high place we're in. Right? This whole city is known as George Town. Mm -hmm. When people say, hey, you're going down town, this is town, this is in the heart of town we're in. Right? Yeah, the, the, yeah, the high the high places, the cheap place. Go on. She cried at the gates, at the entries of the city, and in the coming in at the doors. Exactly, and in the coming in at the door, this is on the main places. Now you know hideout, you know, you know, temple. You could close your eyes and shut the brazen.